Hello everybody and welcome to episode 25 of the Rebuild with Tottenham Hotspur. Today we travel to the bridge to take on Chelsea in the Battle of the Bridge. We've also got one new signing to introduce as well as a host of results to go through. Let's meet the new signing first of all. And that new signing is one Mason Mount. He has joined us on loan from Chelsea with an obligation to buy him for £29 million in the summer. Now, we have made a change. You will see who's gone shortly. But I thought Mason Mount and Declan Rice reunited on the football pitch. Couldn't be anything better, could it? Very good player as well. 26 years of age, so it's an upgrade on what we've lost. And he can play anywhere across the midfield and the three behind the striker. So it is perfect. And I'm hoping it's going to work out. Obviously, he cannot play today against Chelsea because he's on loan from them. And he has replaced Ricardo Hotter, who has joined Manchester United on loan for the rest of the season. Obviously, you can see Masons were up. Ricardo's are going down. So that was the reason for kind of moving him on. He's 30 now. Obviously, we've got enough aging players in the squad so losing one is not a bad thing he only is an option to buy for manchester united it's not an obligation 26 and a half million to start with and then i think it goes to about 40 million plus with add-ons so it's a good deal for us it's a good deal for manchester united and it might work out all round obviously it's helping a rival which i didn't want to do but they were the only club that came along now to those results we've had since we were last together. So we lost to Manchester United last time around, but we did bounce back and beat Southampton. Taremi with two, Sun and Garnacho with the goals. We then beat Chelsea in the reverse fixture, Madison, Kane and Kudusevsky with the goals. But again, we hit a bit of a roadblock when we played Everton. That's two nil-nil draws with Everton this season on Boxing Day. Just couldn't get past them. Did get past Bournemouth though, Harry Kane with a hat-trick. 2-0 win over Wolves, Marcus Edwards and James Madison with the goals. We beat Leeds by the same scoreline, Reina and Romero with the goals. And then we beat Sunderland in a much changed lineup in the FA Cup. To Ramey, Ward Prowse and Hyun Min Sun scoring the winner. So our reward for getting past Sunderland is another championship side and it's away to Sheffield United. The Champions League, those crucial games with Napoli and Barcelona are coming thick and fast so we'll see how we get on with that next time around in the premier league the gap is back to three it was up to eight at one point we've had an amazing run over the christmas period we have a game in hand over manchester united as well they've already played this weekend so we do have the chance to have a six point lead at the top of the premier league table come on can we beat chelsea let's find out so here are the two starting lineups as Chelsea start with Mendy in goal. James, Fafana, Colwell, Chilwell, Kante, Fernandez, Otavio, Soler, Sterling with Kai Havertz leading the line, it would seem, as we start with Costa in goal. Frimpong, Sotalo, Romero, Ogdogi, Rice, Reina, Ward-Prowse, Madison, Coman with Harry Kane leading the line. Now the Battle of the Bridge is an infamous one. Obviously from uh, about four or five years ago now. When we drew 2 all with Chelsea, it cost us the title. To be fair, we were never in the title race with Leicester. Let's be brutally honest. Can we pick up a win over them? Obviously, we've just done it about a month ago. Can we make it a double? Come on. Obviously, we infamously didn't win at Chelsea for a very, very long time. 1990. It was 30-odd years before we won at Chelsea. Beaten 2-1, I think, if I remember rightly. All in white for us today. That's going to be something going through all season. Oh, no. Blue socks with a white ring. Fair enough. Whatever. <laughs> Kingsley Cumberland's has got the ball. Shirts and shorts, eh? I remember when they used to change them every two years. Remember that? And they said, oh, we won't go back to the changing them every year. And now they just change a little thing, and it's really annoying. Anyway, Otavia with the corner for Chelsea. Five minutes in ball in towards the centre and it's headed away. I'm not sure who got it away. Odogi got it away. Soler picks it up. Trying to come around the outside. Will get a shot away. Fires it into the crowd. Obviously a lot of people will be... It's a controversial signing Mason Mount but he's a very very good player. And if Chelsea want to sell him, I'll buy him. Rhys James with a free kick over the top of the wall. Good save from Costa. Turns it around the post for a corner. But Otavia has the corner on the opposite side. Chelsea have started the better. Ball in Towards the near post. 
And Wolf Prowse hits it away. Octavian will have another go. Goes in towards Chilwell. And Costa has got the ball. But he's taking it behind for a corner, has he? No. It definitely looked like he'd taken it behind for a corner. I wouldn't have said it if I didn't think it happened. Kante into Octavia, onto Sterling. We haven't started at all, have we? Frimpon picking up the ball. Sotalo cross into Romero. Ward Prass, this is us now. Working it out from the back. Come on, round the corner. Tries to go early, looking for Harry Kane. Keeper's going to come out. Mendy's whacked it back down the field. Going to come back the other way. Reina into Romero. Looking through for Kingsley Coman. Ogdogi. Plays it into Ward Prowse. Back into Romero. Rice. Ward Prowse again. It's nice. It's tight football, but we're keeping hold of the ball. We're making Chelsea doing a lot of running. Sotalo. Through the gap. I can, oh, I can see the ball to Madison. Couldn't get a goal man on the other side. Go on, Kingsley. Take your mum. Play it towards the centre. Is it going to be an own goal? Is it going to be James Madison? I think Madison heads it in. Chilwell with the mistake at the back post. We lead after 20 minutes. First real attack from us. Kingsley Coman with a superb ball through into the undefendable area that you find around about the penalty spot. Yeah, Ben Chilwell deflects it. James Madison nods it home. As we beat them easily at the lane. We'd love to do the same at Stamford Bridge. Sitalo into Rice. Round the corner for Madison. Having to come back. And he's lost out to Havertz. Sterling. For Havertz, he's playing as the nine. And Soler's going to get in behind. But we are back in numbers. And he's blocked it behind as a dogey. Chelsea will have a chance from the corner. Octavia with it once more. Will he find a Chelsea head? Will he find a Tottenham one? He's found Tottenham one so far. And he's found another one in Kingsley Coman. But he has got the ball again. Back into Kante. Will he have a shot? No, we play it into Havertz. Fofana. And Harry Kane has tried to take the ball away, but Fofana is back on it again. Back into James. Chelsea being pushed back. Go on. That's it. Push him out. Sotalo with the free kick. Plays it into Rice. Sotalo once more. Goes back across to Romero. War Prowse. Back into Romero. Goes early looking for Madison. Lovely ball in behind. Plays it across the front of goal early. And it's headed away. Chilwell completes the clearance. Rayner will pick it up. No, he won't. Sterling will come away with it. Trying to come the opposite way for Chelsea. Up against James Madison and Frimpong together. Can they deal with it? Ball in towards Habits. Saved by Costa. Easily saved by Costa. Good run from Sterling, though. Go short into Ward Prowse. Back towards Costa. Go long. Okay, back into Romero he goes. Rice. Ward Prowse. They are knocking it around between them at the back. Oh, he's giving it straight to Kai Havertz. What a mistake from Romero. We have got away with one there. That's why I don't like us playing it out of the back like that. You are stepping on your own toes at that point. Otavio with the corner. In towards the area. And it's headed away by a Tottenham player again. This time Christian Romero gets it away. Fernandez picks it up though. Well, perhaps we'll complete the clearance. Are we going to get to half time in the league? We'll find out in a second. Zidane's trying to get his players going. Rhys James coming down the right. Will he swing it into the middle? He will, looking for the back post. And Sotalo heads it clear. Chilwell heads it down for Sterling. Kante. Tries to chip it in. Raheem Sterling's in behind. And it's 1-1, is it? Are they going to have a look at offside? It might be very tight. No one's really celebrating. We're surrounding the referee, trying to find out the decision. Andy Madley has checked with VAR. And the goal has been given. Let's have a look at it then. Raheem Sterling with the equaliser right on half time. Ball through from Chilwell. Yeah, he's miles on. Frimpong is the man playing him on. We'll see the lines in a second. I think we don't really need to see them. It wasn't a tight call at all, really. No. About a yard on. Defensive line, not great. 1 1. And that is half time. To be fair to Chelsea, they probably deserve that. They've had the better of the shots. We've just had the one on target so far, but we have had it in the net. So, you know, we're one for one. Can we be two for two and three for three? Let's see what happens. Throw in. No doggy with it. He throws it on to Reina. And loses out to Soler. Reina's won it back, though. Not really been in the game so far, Giovanni Reina. Plays it on to Kingsley Coman, though. Will he get a shot away? He will. Mendy will turn it over the bar. Okay, so we're not two for two on the shots on target anymore. But James Ward Prowse is going to take this corner. Is he going to find a Tottenham head? I would hope so. We'll see. 
Ball into the area. Will he find anybody? No, Mendy comes and claims. Corner to Chelsea. And it's going to be Otavia to take it. What will he do with it? He will play it in towards the back post. Colwell has risen, but he's saved by Costa. And what's he going to do with it? Diego Costa, I wonder. Is he going to lump it down the field? He's going to throw it to Romero. <laughs> Didn't think it was going to make it. Ward Prowse into... Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. Long. No, not into Totalo. On to Rice. We're going we're gonna to muck it up again, aren't we? They are waiting for us to make a mistake. A doggy's got the ball now. That's it. Go forward. Goodness me. It's nice football, but it's painful when it doesn't work out. Come on. Coming down the left-hand side. Got bodies in the box. Can he find any one of them? He will go in towards Harry Kane, who's tapped it in. Near enough on the goal line. That's what HK does. He finds himself in an area. And all the knocking it around at the back is worth it. Because when we spring forward into attack, it is beautiful. Kingsley Coman coming inside the penalty area. Easy pass across the front of goal. Undefendable once more. And we're back in front. Harry Kane had a quiet game up until that point. And he has sprung to life. Right, let's have a look at a couple of changes, shall we? Madison going to be one, maybe? Rain has had a better second half. Ward Prowse is definitely going to be one. Roberigo Bentancur is going to come on for him. Uh, Sotalo is going to come off. We're going to bring on a Kanji. And we'll leave it like that for now. Colwell with the free kick for Chelsea. 20 to play. Still very much on a knife edge, this one. As Fernandez goes wide, looking for Solaire. Kingsley Coman tracking back to help out. Him and Son will probably be on shortly for Kingsley Coman. Not much in the tank from him, sadly. Good save from Costa. Right, let's have a look at another couple of changes with 12 to play. Kingsley Coman is going to come off. Him and Son is going to come on for him. And we're going to make a change on the opposite side. Kudusevsky is going to come on for James Madison. As we look to see this one out. Got just over 10 minutes or so, I would say, plus added. So Colville with the free kick for Chelsea into Kovacic. Octavia looking through. Akanji will pick that up. Goes home. Don't sod about with it. Not again. Not again. Not again. There we go. Frimpong. Turn. Plays it up the line for Kulisewski. Round the corner for Reina. Nice touch from him. Bodies making their way forward. And Reina has lost out to Kukurea. He's playing in midfield by the looks of it. Reina picks it up. Well tracked back. Benson Kuk gives it back to him though. Goal got very scrappy in the last few minutes. Ball in behind to Lukaku. Will he square it across to Havertz? He will. It's 2-2. Chelsea scoring one from close range this time. We gave the ball away in midfield. And Romelu Lukaku with an assist for Chelsea. And it's Desmond. We panicked in the centre. And we gave it away. Raheem Sterling with a lovely ball in behind. And that is 2-2. In fairness, on the balance of play, it's probably about right at this point. We will extend our lead to Manchester United, but only by the one. Unless Otavia can fire this in, and he might well have done, but Costa has got there. Goodness me. Free kick into the dying seconds. We've blown it twice at Stamford Bridge, which is disappointing. But as I said, on the balance of play, Chelsea probably deserved something from it. They were better in front of goal than we were. And 2-2 is the final score. But with it all level at the top of the table on games now, we are four points ahead of Manchester United with 13 Premier League games to come. So what we will do next time, we will concentrate on the Champions League taking on Barcelona. So we'll take on Napoli and Manchester City in between. Obviously, wanting to get into the top eight, neither of us are in there at the moment. So it could be a very big game at not the new Camp. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you've enjoyed it, please leave a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.